Hey, it's me, Zarnovan. Welcome back to Elden Ring, the 100% playthrough. How are we doing, ladies and gentlemen? I am having a fantastic time myself. If you are enjoying this series as much as I am enjoying playing it, please consider liking, please consider subscribing. Every like means I get a new like, and every subscribe means I get a new subscriber, and it all cumulatively really, 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 really helps me out more than I can put into words and describe to you through the vector of video. But in any case, if you saw the end of the last episode, you already know what we're getting on with. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you already know what we are getting on with let's uh let's get torrent out and let's begin this big old bad boy let's start it on up i'm not even going to not even gonna wait let's just rush straight into it excuse me crabs we'll deal with you later i'm not even interested right now i have got something much bigger in mind and we are riding right towards it Oh, it's so cool. I love that they have things like this in the game. Oh, I don't even know. I cannot. I do not want to take any damage. I want to be at 100% when we come into contact with this bad boy. Here we go. All right, I really want to take this guy down. I, that is like the... I know, I know I wanted to get map markers and put together map fragments and whatnot and blah, 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 blah. But come on. Like, how can you not? How can you not want to take this guy on? Let's do it. Boom. 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 Back it on up. Boom. 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 Come on. Boom. Here we go. Boom. Gosh, we need more stamina. Boom. And boom. 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 And okay, back up, Torrent. Back up, back up, back up. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. And heal. And we'll, we won't heal again. We'll save that. Can I get the militiamen out from on horseback? Okay, maybe I can. Let's do that. They could be very handy. Okay, while he's doing that, let's get around to the back of him real quick. Boom, boom, boom. And let's wait. Oh, no, no, no. Come on, don't kill me like this. Not like this, not like this, not like this. Let's do that. And Torrent, please. Oh, there we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let's get these guys out. Don't die straight away, please. <laughs> get out of my way. Get out of my way. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I hate getting caught up on those things. All right. So, it looks like he did a lot of damage to them right off the bat, but we're going to try and sneak around to the back of him. Let's have one of these flasks while we're riding. And... Oh, just as I got in contact with you, hey? Holy... Get away from all of that fire. Jeepers. Okay. He's definitely doable, but it's just hard. As soon as... When, whenever he tries... Whenever he decides to cast fire, it's so difficult. Okay, boom. 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 Might be an idea to just jump off torrent when uh, we're doing this. Or even just slow down and just stay... Yeah, that's probably the way to do it. It's just to stop running around because of, we're losing so much potential damage. Oh. We're losing so much potential damage by running around. Okay. Plan of attack. Plan of attack going in here because there's some things that I feel like we need to do in order to help ourselves out here. Uh, one of those, first and foremost, obviously being leveling up. Let's take that mushroom. Let's go grab our runes. And what we might do is, come on, let's get through here, Torrent. Let's, let's skip over that crab. I'm not really interested in trying to kill it. And what we might do, instead of just going straight after the dragon, we might go to the smith at the round table hold because there are some definite upgrades that I think I would like to get that I am aware of now and especially because we have so many materials that we can actually use to help us I feel like it would be foolish not to and it could really help us out in general not even just against this dragon just in general so let's travel here yes travel to the round table hold and let's go see that smith we've got absolutely no runes coming here could have definitely come here a bit more rich and in a bit of a better position i saw you out in the wild didn't i after i killed the tibia over the marina uh, hello again hello you haven't gone to see garank yet have you no i well, haven't i apologize no rush you do as you please just as long as he doesn't starve to death hey Yes, that would be terrible. Wouldn't want that. Okay, let's find the smith. <laughs> I'm sorry, my friend, but I'm trying to fight a dragon right now, and there, there's just there's a there's a hierarchy of priorities, and dragon is right at the top for me. So, well, where have you been hiding? I took you for dead. 
No matter, it's all the same. Lay out your arms then. Let's do it. Okay, so strength and armament. Let's go. Boom. Uh, make broadsword plus one for 280 runes. Uh, yeah, I would think that's definitely what I want to do. I just want to make sure. Right? Is this... Yeah, this, this sword is better. But that sword is probably the best. But we need more strength. We need 16 strength to actually wield it properly. Mm, do I want to... Do I want to... Hmm... Decisions, decisions, decisions... Yeah, let's just... Oh, so many decisions. Oh, we can wield the crossbow now, it looks like. There's no longer a cross next to it, so we've got enough strength for that. Might switch over to that instead of the crossbow... Instead of the bow and arrow now. Okay, what we might do... Oh, my goodness, there's so many things. Okay. There are some definite... Come on, Elden Ring loads. What, what do you, what do you... There we go. Okay, let's, uh, let's go back here. And what I feel like I might do is I'm going to probably just try my best to, uh... I'm just going to start killing random things, just try and get a, a whole bunch of levels and runes and whatnot, and then I will bring you guys back, because I feel like what, I feel like what's holding us back the most in this whole playthrough is literally just our level. Like, that's probably the main thing that's holding us back. I just don't have enough health to do things, I don't have enough stamina to do things, I don't have enough focus to do things, I just don't have enough, like, strength to hold bigger weapons and whatnot, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to farm for a little bit, I would say, and then I'll bring you guys right back. Okay guys, I am back. I have done a bunch of farming and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take you guys through just one just one um uh, cycle of what I was doing to, you know, in quotation marks, farm. Definitely not the best way to do it, I would say. There's probably way better methods out there, but I just didn't look it up because I didn't want to do stuff off camera and go off to all these different places. And, you know, yeah, do stuff off camera that you guys couldn't see. So I just kept it simple. I just stuck around this lake. And essentially what I was doing was I was just calling in the good old torrent, the steed. And I was running down here. And as I said, each one of these crabs give you, I think it's 318 per time you kill them. And they're pretty easy to kill. Like, as you can see, once you jump on the horse, you just stay around the back of them. And you just do that. And then it's... 318 runes right off the bat there and then also once you come over here another two will come out and then from there i mean they usually tend to do a lot of the work for you like that one out the back will tend to do a lot of damage on this one while it's trying to hit you sometimes which makes it even quicker again doesn't seem like it's going to happen this time but yeah sometimes he'll like hammer down his claw and do a lot of damage and kill that one like he would have just killed that one then for me if i didn't get that last swing off and then, you know, you do this for this guy. You kill him as well. <laughs> it's pretty. It's a pretty simple formula. It's pretty quick. It, uh, it didn't really take me all that long to accumulate all the runes that I have now. So we'll have plenty of level ups, good and ready to go. So I've also been collecting the crab eggs. Uh, so we've got a ton of crab eggs. <laughs> uh, probably we might sell them. I was also coming over here every so often and killing this guy as well. Because he's pretty easy to kill. And I think he gives you like 300 and something runes. He's definitely not difficult to kill. Um, he's, yeah, he's pretty quick. He's uh, pretty easy to dodge the attacks. Uh, just quickly heal myself here. And dodge that attack and come back around. Get him off his horse. And once he's off his horse, he's even easier again. So, oh... Oh geez, I'm doing terrible now that I'm talking and not concentrating. But you get the you get the idea. You get the gist. It's pretty easy. So now he's off the horse, and now he's dead. Let's uh, jump off and search the horse. Pillage corpse, sliver of meat, delicious. Yum yum yum. Nom 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 nom. I'm just gonna chuck that in my back pocket. All right, let's grab torrent again. And then the last crab is just over here. So yeah, essentially what I was doing, I was uh, just killing all four crabs, which at 318 runes each, it's basically just over 1,200 runes per cycle. And it's pretty quick, it's pretty easy. There's also a lot of uh, skulls on the ground uh, that you can quickly run over and pick up as well to give you golden runes. So I've actually got more runes in my inventory than what you guys can actually see because I've picked up a bunch of golden runes as well. We'll see if we can find any just quickly to give you an example. But yeah, every so often you'll see those skulls with like the glowing eyes. Like I think there's one over here. Oh no, that's a mushroom. But I'm sure you guys, I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about at this point. So we'll pick that up. Oh, it's a ruined fragment. 
I'm sure you guys know what I'm. I'm sure. I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about at this point when I mention the uh, the skulls with the glowing eyes and it looks like I missed something here. So I'll pick that up, and then we will fast travel to the site of Lost Grace, and from there, basically the cycle just continues. And I was just doing that over and over and over again. Not the most enthralling thing in the world, but you know, it's good to. It's definitely been good to get me a ton of runes. So now I want to do this with you guys so we are going to quickly check my inventory i won't have a, a a staggering amount of golden runes but i'll have a few there we go 14 so you selected let's go all 14 boom let's see how much that gives us it's going to be a good chunk 2800 so there we go 40,000 runes all up let's rest at the site of lost grace and from here we are going to level up our guy a lot so here we go. Let's go. I definitely want some health ups. So boom. And then we'll go boom and boom. So we'll go three health ups. And then we'll go some strength ups and some dexterity. And we already can't level up again. <laughs> All that work and we already can't level up again. So I wanted to maybe not, hmm, maybe not dexterity. Maybe we'll go endurance and may and yeah we'll keep that strength there because that just increases our attack damage in general okay okay i think i'm happy with that so we're jumping from level 27 to level 33 three of the levels are health uh increases so we're going from 572 to 652 a pretty good jump i would say endurance from 13 to 14 so going from so endurance affects your maximum equip load as well as strength. That's it. Oh no, strength doesn't uh, doesn't affect your maximum equipment load. It seems. Ah, oh, interesting. I thought it did. Okay. So yeah, our strength is going up twice, endurance up once, and then we're still going to have six thousand two hundred fifty nine runes. But we'll hold on to that because so we'll confirm this. Yes, spend thirty four thousand five hundred twenty runes and level up. Yes, please. Boom, boom, boom. Now. I'm excited to see what our health looks like now. So let's come out of here. Let's jump on Torrent. And there was a couple things I did that were off camera. It was... I basically jumped up to the top of that and I got something called... What was it? It was... Oh, I keep doing that thing and it's going to give me my inventory. I jumped up to the top of uh, that little ruined castle thing there and i got can i find ah there we go i got a slumbering egg i got no idea what it's for but it's obtained found by hunting owls so there you go so i got that up there nothing super important i would say also just gonna have to get a little quick cut here and I am back. Oh my goodness, I am sorry guys. This episode has got a lot more cuts than I would ever want to have in an episode for Elden Ring being the nature of the game that it is. I'm sorry, I just had to quickly talk to uh, I, uh, uh, someone from FedEx because they're, they've uh, <laughs> been holding up a, a package from me for quite a while now and it's because they simply didn't check that I had sent them the attachment that they were asking for and they just uh, i sent it to them like a week ago and they just completely missed it but in any case let's get back into elden ring so yeah i was doing uh i was farming the runes over there and i wanted to keep some rooms runes spare because i also found this guy under here and i'm hoping he can give me something i haven't seen before and we're going to take his butterflies real quick i'm just going to take that smoldering butterfly from you Let's jump off Torrent and see what he has for us. Oh my goodness, please have a staff. You would be my favorite NPC ever if you did. Ah, you must be the new Tarnish. That is I. Quite the fool by the look of it. Ah. A fight with a dragon. <laughs> well, trying. Wow. I can tell you want to see it through. Seems I'm forever crossing paths with hotheads like you. Okay, anything else? I can tell you want to see it through. Fools will be fools. Fight all the dragons you like. Uh-huh. I can tell you want to see it through. Fools will... Okay, so you don't have anything interesting. Well, that... <laughs> Thank you for that. Maybe we have to kill that dragon and then we can come back and he'll do something. Well... 
lucky for us and lucky for him if that is the case that is exactly what i intend on doing and that is why i wanted to get all of those levels what are you guys i've never seen you before I'm just going to quickly run over and kill you. <laughs> Real quick, I hope you don't mind. Just never seen you before. What are these things? What in the what? I've never seen them before. Okay, well, let's throw a fireball at them. Boom. So they're not super strong, which is good. Let's kill him, and let's kill his buddy, and let's dodge that. A bit a little bit late, but let's, let's uh, when we're ready, let's do that. Boom, boom. Now he's dead. Let's pillage corpse, see what they have. Oh, so you guys are where we get string from. Okay, okie dokie. Okay, that's good to know. That is very good to know. Thank you very much for your help. Let's take this golden rune as well. Anything down here of interest? Potentially, possibly. Don't think so. Now, also, another thing that I saw when I uh, jumped up there and I got the slumbering egg, I also saw, yeah, here we go. I saw another site of grace, which I didn't, as I said, I did not want to do anything, anything aside from cycling those crabs off camera. So you can be confident that I've, you haven't missed anything at all, I promise. So we've just picked up this site of Lost Grace. Now, is there anything else? I don't believe so. So from here, what I wanted to do was go back to the uh, the round table hold. And then from there, I want to see if it is here or at sites of Lost Grace where I have to, uh, have to uh what is it activate those cookbook recipe things because i'm thinking maybe those are other ways i can get health i'm not sure but we'll have to see uh where is the smith there you are my friend hello so great to see you well, i took you for dead i would never die so let's, lay out your arms, then. let's lay out the arms and let's strengthen our armaments so with the upgrade in strength yes indeed that is what i wanted to see so now we can use the lord sword the Lord Swan's Great Sword. Uh, I also picked up this from one of the horse guys as they were riding past. This is something that uh, they dropped. Probably won't use that. I'm more keen on using this. So the Lord Swan's Great Sword. Let's equip it first before I do anything that I might regret because that is a very big possibility. We're going to take this bow off and equip the crossbow instead because I'm going to assume... Oh no, the bow actually has more damage. That is interesting, but the I would say the crossbow probably shoots a bit faster. Hmm. So how many slots do we have? Okay, we'll just keep the bow there for now. We might just swap the sword out because if I do have, if this is a better sword, I'll probably use it. Uh, and it's looking like it is better in pretty much every single way. But I think my yeah, okay. Yeah, but it's just a bit. It's just a little bit lighter. But for the equipment load, I've got. Plenty, so I've got 38.1 out of 54. So we're good for that. Um, what is this like? That is also not as good. Okay, let's see what that looks like. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now it's a... Is this like a two-handed thing for us to use now? Okay, I guess that's the animation. Yeah, okay, so cool, cool, cool. Happy with that. Jeez, uh, oh, okay. I, I quickly want to fast travel out of here. Just to see what it's actually like to use this thing before I start upgrading it. Uh, to see if I do actually want to use a big old sword like this. Because can I use a shield with it? I can. Oh, okay. But it's just like a bit of a slower attack it looks like. I can work with that though, I feel like. I feel like I can definitely work with that. Okay. Alright, let's go back to the round table hold. Again, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to work things out. I'm trying to make my guy nice and powerful. So, let's go back to the smith who is through here. And we're going to skip through his dialogue because I think he says the same thing pretty much every time. Hey, buddy. Well, yep. Nope. Yep, I shall. There we go. Strength and armament now. Is this indeed what I want to strengthen? Hmm, I'm second guessing myself here because this will go plus 20. So this will get pretty strong anyway, but it does also attack a lot quicker. Oh, it's such, such, it's a bit of, it is a bit of a trade-off, isn't it? It is definitely a bit of a trade-off. Am I happy for the trade-off? You know what? I, I take it back. I take it back. We might instead, I will keep this one just because i'm used to i'm used to my attacks with this sword so i might keep that for now 
as the main. Um, however, we can put this in our other hand, can't we? So we can go dual attack, dual swords, right? How does that look? That looks funky. <laughs> that looks crazy. Okay, uh, but I dare say that'll just be like a heavier left attack and a lighter right attack. So if I want to attack quickly... Yeah, okay, let's do... We'll keep it like that then. Cool. Yes, indeed. Uh-huh. And let's strengthen this. Boom. And let's strengthen it again. Boom. And we can't strengthen it again. Let's strengthen this. Boom. And why not let's strengthen our bow as well. Boom. And why can't I strengthen anything else? Oh, I'm out of smithing stones. Dang. Okay, yeah, I completely forgot smithing stones is also something I needed. Okay, that's all good, though. I'm still happy with that. Still very, very happy. Uh, anything else I could potentially want? I don't think so. And now, Ash of War, Duplication, Wild Strikes, Unsheath, Determination. What I might go is on this one, I might put on Determination. So let's quickly have a look at the Ashes of War themselves, if I can. Uh, I believe this is an actual thing that you want to take note of. So when you look at your Ashes of War, is that in here? Yes. So in the description there, it says like Wild Strikes, Heavy unsheath keen and determination and quality i think what essentially what it is when it gives you that uh choice of what you want to or how you want to apply the uh ash of war to your weapon essentially you can either go standard or you can go quality which is uh like what the uh the like that 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 I don't know how I don't know how to explain it the way it was explained to me was very kind of general as well it's just that I've just from what I've been led to believe that's just what you how you want to apply it although it's looking like I get 130 plus 22 if I go standard and then 111 plus 30 if I go Quality. Okay, so it looks like my sword's damage will decrease to 111, but if I activate uh, Determination, I'll get plus 30 on it. But if I keep it just regular, I'll go 130 and I'll get plus 22. I definitely feel like I want to keep it standard then, actually. So maybe that wasn't described to me correctly. Okay, so now we've got the Ash of War on that. Uh, do I want this on anything? Uh, remove these. No, 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 no. We'll definitely keep that on our little sword because that'll be my main weapon still for a while, I think. We can now carry these shields as well, which are just better in general, it looks like, in pretty much every single attribute. So, might go into our inventory and... or our equipment, sorry, and we'll get rid of this shield and we'll equip a brass shield. And my equipment load is still very good. We are still good to go. 45.6 out of 54. Very nice. We're looking good here. We're looking real good. I do like the looks of this. We've leveled up. We've got a good a chunk of health. We've got a better shield. We got a, we've upgraded our sword. We're doing, we're doing good. We're doing good. Now, all I need to do is find people that will sell me staffs. <laughs> I found someone who will sell me glintstone sorceries. <laughs> Now I just need a glintstone staff to actually be able to wield it. Do you ah, change you anything? You to be doing well. Very good. Well, Indeed. Then. Would you like to learn an incantation? Indeed uh, I would. So do you change your incantations based on my level? Doesn't look like it. Or maybe I've got to upgrade faith specifically and then you unlock more incantations. I'm unsure. Unsure as to how that works. But okay. golden order shine through you. And you as well. Now, let's go back into our map. Let's go back to here. And let's try and kill ourselves a dragon. <laughs> I'm so keen to finally get this started. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Limgrave. And we will get out our spectral steed a torrent. And we're going to make our way down there. Now, hopefully, we're going to do... Hopefully, the whole point of this was we're going to do more damage with our sword. In fact, what I should do, probably, is have this sword out while I'm attacking with torrents. So, let's go into equipment. Sorry, there's so many little changes. I've just, I'm just trying to, like, really hone in on the best way to have this all laid out. So, instead of dual-wielding swords, what we could do is this instead. And how quickly do I attack... 
And what is the damage of this thing compared to... So, physical, 143 plus 25. 130 plus 22. Okay, so yeah, this definitely... Although this does attack a bit quicker. Hmm. Hmm. We'll just see how they go. I'll just, I'll just swap between the two in the fight and see which one feels a bit better to use. Because obviously... This attacks quicker, so it could be it could have a better DPS, but then also the big broadsword, like wearing the we might only be getting a couple hits out anyway before we have to, you know, get out of dodge anyway with this dragon. So yeah, it's a bit of a bit of a bit of a catch a bit of a double edged sword, no pun intended. Okay, let's see if we can sneak up on this dragon and we'll get a determination critical hit off. So let's jump off that. Let's sneak up to him. Let's see if I can we'll get this shield out. Now with determination, is this how it works? Indeed it is. So let, now let's sneak up with him while determination is there and missed it. <laughs> bad idea, bad idea. Jump on the horse. <laughs> let's get out of here. All right, let's heal ourselves. Bad start, but we'll be fine. I don't feel like it's going to be too much of a bad thing for us. Let's summon these guys. Just as distractions. There we go. Because I don't actually... I don't actually think they're going to do too much. I just want them there as a distraction. Things like that. Where we can just come to the side here and boom. 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 And then boom. See, look at that. Very nice. Uh, there we go. And boom. 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 And out of there. And back over to this side. Boom. Boom, and there we go. Okay, I already feel like we're doing a lot better here. A lot better. We've done so much more damage right off the bat. Let's uh, not get hit by whatever that is, because that looks very terrible for our health. And our skeletal militiamen are still going strong. This is why I love them, because they take damage. But if there isn't a continuous damage done to them, they just kind of reanimate. So they're, they are probably the most valuable... Um, spectral summons I think you can get really in my opinion let's get out of here see now look at that they're down they're dead technically but they're just going to reanimate because he's not going to kill them completely let's start hitting the wing here while we're stuck on it might as well and keep hitting the legs and back on out of there before we die let's drink one of these and let's get See if we can get up and under him. There we go. And stay away from that leg. And boom, boom, boom. Stay away from that leg. And boom, boom. There we go. Doing well, doing well, doing well. Back on up. Skeletal militiamen are still alive. Oh my goodness. This is why I love them so much. These guys are so good. They're just the best distractions in the world. Let's keep going with this. Keep on attacking his legs. Keep on attacking the knees. Gosh, did I just... I did. I did just die. Woo! I was not expecting that tail attack to be so powerful. <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> that dragon does not mess about. My goodness. Oh, but I'm so determined. I want to kill him. I want to defeat this dragon. So, let's jump back on... Uh, why is this... Why am I finding that so hard? There we go. Let's jump back on Torrent. And let's give it one more crack. I'll give it one more crack again before we cut it short again because as i've said i'm not i've definitely learned uh, get away from those crabs i've definitely learned from the previous episodes and just my previous gameplay in general that you know if you're not ready to defeat something just accept it it's a lot better to accept it than to spend copious amounts of time running and dying 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 I wonder what episodes they were. I think it was like episode 3 and maybe episode 5. I don't know. The two episodes where I encountered the first two bosses of the play of the playthrough ever. And they were just awful to deal with both times. <laughs> both times. I just did not learn my lesson. I kept running in and dying. Now, I want to try this again. Because I feel like it can be done. And all of a sudden, he I think he's seen me. So it can't be done. Let's just run up behind him and hit him. Can I get determination on the horse? No. What if I get rid of Torrent, get Determination, get back on Torrent? Do I still have Determination? Let's see. Come on, kill him. Just hit him once. There we go. 
I feel like that was a lot of damage. I feel like that was definitely determination helping us out there. Get in close, hit him in the face, hit him there on the leg, there, and there, and back out of that. Get some stamina ups to hit, and hit, and hit. We could definitely do back up that way from that tail. Let's get these, okay, before we get these guys out, we're going to dodge all these flames first. And now we'll get these skeletal militiamen out. Do your thing, guys. Just be annoyances to this dragon and stay alive forever. Please and thank you. Let's crush this skull while we're here. Why not? And take the golden rune. Love that. Okay. Now, hopefully, yes, he is focusing on them. Very, very good. Very, very good. And let's go over this way now. Please focus back on the militiamen. That is what they are there for. They are there to distract you. I do not want you to be going at me, please. Okay, let's attack these legs real quick. Let's keep going with these legs. Just stay under them. But I'm pretty sure if we stay under them. Oh, gosh, that is a terrible attack to get caught by. Let's heal ourselves real quick. Boom. Let's... Now, this might be silly, but uh, he wouldn't do... He, the fire damage wouldn't do anything to him. Like, if I threw a fireball at him, that wouldn't do anything. I don't think so. I'm not going to bother. Uh, okay. And we're going to run away from that. Perfect. Keep on distracting him, Skeletal Militiamen. You guys are doing perfect. I love you. I love you. Uh, again, I missed the dodge of that. Let's heal ourselves. What we can do also that I'm just thinking about now is with those crabs there, I can quickly, once we get low enough, I can quickly, oh, run away. I can quickly go kill one of them and refill all of our flasks just so long as I can kill him before the boss uh, focuses on us. There we go. On the leg. That's what I want to see. Perfect, 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 perfect. Keep focusing on those militiamen because they just don't die. And back on up and don't tell me. Are you... Oh. We got him down to halfway. We were doing so good. We were doing so good. And then he just gives us one big chomp and we're dead. Okay. As I said, I've learned my lesson. We'll leave it there. Uh, let's go and where can we all, oh, you know who I feel like we can take on now? We can definitely go and take on this lady, I feel like. I feel like we def, yeah, yeah, let's do that. Because I want, because <laughs> I really, <laughs> I really want to kill her. I really, really do. I love having these random NP, well, not the random NPCs, but having these, uh, what do they call them? I forget, I forget the, I forget the word now. I love having these... Uh, what is it? I don't know. The, the things where they spawn into your world, it's, I know it's the incorrect way to say it, but where they spawn into your world and then you have to try and kill them, I love it. Uh, invasions, that's it. Yeah, I love it when, they, when you have invasions. I don't know why, it's just such a fun concept. Just such a fun thing. Okay, and back on up. And oh no, I completely forgot actually. I didn't go and pick up my 5,000 runes. Ooh, okay, I guess the pressure is on to actually kill her. Because if I don't, we could be in some trouble. Now, where is she? There you are. And taking damage. Perfect. That's what I love to see. Okay, time to test out how we go. Now, not going to bother throwing those at her. She'll just dodge them. Let's lock onto her. And we'll have the shield out and ready. Come on. Do something. Not falling for that rot. And hit and hit and back it on up, back it on up. And block. Yeah, see, that's what I've been doing this whole time. I just haven't had the shield up and ready to block like crazy attacks. Oh gosh. Back up, 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 back up. Oh, I'm heavy. Why am I heavy? Okay, this isn't good actually. I am way heavier than I should be. I need to like unequip something real quick. I thought I wasn't heavy. And hit. Nope. That didn't work out at all. Let's heal ourselves real quick and keep the shield up. Keep the shield up. Do something. Nope. Not going to let you do that. And, and oh my goodness. And now I've lost those runes. That's upsetting. That is, that is very upsetting. <laughs> very upsetting. I think it was like 5,000 runes I've just forfeited now because I completely forgot about them and just died. <sighs> 
That is the thing. That That is the most upsetting thing about recording is you forget so many things you would never usually forget just because you're providing commentary and because you're thinking of things to say and whatnot. And so you forget things you normally wouldn't forget. And because you forget things that you wouldn't normally forget, it just it just makes it so much worse when you actually do so when you actually do die from it. So I'm thinking this is the best way to actually do it is to run over these things because then we won't get any poison effects. So we can have minimum poison effect as we run back here. Perfect. Okay. Now we can't summon the Spectral Steed anymore. I am the... Oh, no. I completely forgot. Let's quickly run back here as far as we can before she comes. Let's quickly try and sort out whatever it is that is making me too heavy. Uh, let's get rid of this thing. Now, you can tell you're super heavy because... There we go. You can tell you're super heavy when you do like a really heavy roll. I only found that, that out the other day as well. So now we should be good to go. We should have more endurance. Let's hit her. Boom. Back it on up. Just going to play it super safe now. And hit her. See, look at that. Boom. That attack usually just kills us right off the bat, but now it doesn't. Let's quickly have a little health potion. And I don't think I had any runes, but I kind of want to go see and just pick them up real quick if I did. Where are they? There they are. Ah, oh, yes. Zero runes. Perfect. And what in the what is that? Okay, so I had no idea that they could do that to me. Um, so I can't just rely on the shield like I thought. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my goodness, this game is just unforgiving. It just, oh my gosh. All right, okay, okay. Uh, okay, let's do it again, I guess. Get, uh, get Torrent back out. We'll get her to spawn back in the world. Here we go. Yep, Melissant has invaded. Perfect, that's what I want. Okay, and now let's run back over here. Jump and jump and over here. Invaded by Melissant. Perfect, that's what I want to see. Alright, now that I know she can do that, I'm not going to just be a little... I'm not going to be as blasé with the shield up close and personal. Um, what we could do, actually... As she... Okay. I'm going to start using this determination a lot more because I'm pretty sure that actually boosts the damage by a significant bit. So, we'll wait for her to get a bit closer because I think there is obviously a timer on the determination. So, determination and lock onto her. Let her do that. And hit. Let me hit her, please. There we go. 138. Perfect. Determination again. Block that. And hit. Perfect. And determination again. And wait for her to do that. And hit. Oh, I forgot she can do that twice. Oh. That is so crazy strong. The fact that she can do that twice. Okay, so I think it's if I'm far enough away, she won't continue doing it. But if I am close, she will just keep on doing it. I got to remember that attack. But if I'm... Okay, I got to remember. If I'm close enough, she will just continue it. So I really do have to create that distance to the point where she just stops doing it. Yeah, let's collect the zero runes. Why not? Uh, okay, let's spawn her in again. Come on, Zanab. Learn from your mistakes. Learn from your mistakes. Spawn her in. Jump over here. Okay, okay, there we go. Getting rid of all that poison effect. Minimizing it as much as we can. And over here we go. Jump and sweet. Invaded by Melissant. That is fine. That is all good. It is all good. We're still doing dandy. Zero runes. Perfect. Love to get that. I still can't believe I just let 5,000 runes go. I am truly upset with myself for that. I have not forgotten. Do not worry, guys. I'm kicking myself for it. Uh, okay, so we'll have heal at the ready. Determination and shield. Boom. Lock onto her. Shield ready. Boom. And boom. Dump that out. And keep on backing on up. Let her do that. Learn from the mistake where she will continue it if you're close enough. Determination and shield up. And hit. Please hit. Please hit. There we go. And oh my gosh. That there was my fault. I did. I, instead of pressing the shield button, I pressed the determination button. I've just got to... Oh. <laughs> I have to laugh or I will cry. My 
goodness, this game does not give you a single inch to play with. Like, it, it's as simple as you press the wrong button and boom, you're dead. Try again. See you later. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. You failed. That's all there is to it. Oh, man. Okay. Let's give it a go. Because we definitely can kill her. I'm, I'm, I am I'm, know there's... I know I'm getting... I, I know I'm aware I'm getting caught in the trap of the whole... Come on, we can do it. I know I can do it. I'm just going to stay out because I know I can do it. I know I'm getting caught in that. I know I am. But it's just... It's just... It's tugging at my very soul because I know it can be done. It's just a matter of timing everything right. And all you have to do is time everything right. And I just don't have... I just can't make those silly mistakes. Just can't make the silly mistakes. That's it. Maybe... A good strategy could be if I like keep her in there for longer so she like takes more damage on her way over here and she didn't take any damage on the way over here okay that's not good <laughs> let's have some healing flasks at the ready this is where it would be good to have some glintstone sorcery I reckon while she's like running up at me so determination and have the shield at the ready back up back up back up back up and hit back up determination and hit back up and back up back up back up don't get caught in anything behind me please and hit back up 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 oh my goodness that was so that was another death so close uh back up just keep on backing up let her do her thing determination and lock onto her again why did you unlock from her back up back up back up and hit back up and let's drink a flask why not we've already got her down at half health try and remain aware of what is around me because that is difficult while i'm running backwards heal up and can i do i have time for a determination okay oh my gosh i almost died there oh my goodness i would have been very upset okay determination is active hit and don't let it no are you kidding me why if i block something and i'm successful why am i then caught in an animation where i am punished for it i know i get it it's from software i get that you gotta be punished but like if if i block all those things then once she breaks the block let me dodge don't have me stuck in an animation where she just sticks the sword right through me and then i'm forced to <laughs> oh my goodness okay let's give it another crack we can do it we are so close to doing it she does not have a huge health pool like regular bosses and whatnot it can be done we were so close just then i just i just uh relied on the block too much and thought i'd be able to dodge my mistake my mistake i'll accept it i'll own it that's my bad i know it's my bad it's my bad i can't i can't get angry at the game that has very set in stone mechanics i can't be upset or anything like that all right all right all right all right where are you there you are please take some damage and you're not taking any damage <laughs> already kicking goals here team Let's get some determination going about there. And what's going to be your opening attack? Nothing. Boom. So I'll attack you. Good. And determination again. And attack. Attack you. Attack you. I feel like it's also me. I feel like I've got to be slightly more offensive than I, what I'm actually being as well. Like more willing to follow up on attacks. So back up, back up, back up, back up. See, she goes for it again. That's not right. That's not right. To do that to do that so quickly one after the other come on now not fair blast 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 back up back up back up back up back up back up are you kidding me what in the world there is no way so she does oh man she's literally her attacks are literally you get hit once dead i know it's not quite like that but oh does it seem like that Okay, let's give it one more crack before I give up. <laughs> before I accept defeat, which I probably should have done a couple times ago now. It's just, oh, it's just, I know I can do it. I know I sound like a broken record because I keep saying I know I can do it. And I know this is probably the pain everyone feels, but it's, you know, you can do it. That's, that is the most, it just tears at your heartstrings. It just tears at the very soul, at the very like fibers of your being. Cause you're like, this is so doable. 
but I'm just making silly mistakes and you're just getting punished for it so bad. Like you make these mistakes all the time in other games, but in this one, it is no joke. It's you made a mistake, death, try again. <laughs> it's so unforgiving. I'm just not used to it. Okay. She's taking some damage. We're already kicking some goals. That's good. Uh, okay. Let's wait for her to get a bit closer. And now determination. Probably did that a little bit too late. Back up, back up. Oh, no. No, no, no. I've, I've made it. I've, I've... Okay. Okay. It didn't punish me and kill me there for it. Thank you so much, Elden Ring. Thank you for giving me the chance. Okay. Don't rely on the block because she will just do that crazy kill move on me. Wait for her to do this. Go forward and that again. Oh. My goodness, that attack is insane. That attack is so crazy. <laughs> okay. Oh. That is going to have to do it. <laughs> that is going to have to do it for me. <laughs> All right, uh, that is going to have to do it for today's episode, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. That episode was filled with pain, a lot of deaths, but we did level up a lot. We did get a fair bit done. Uh, so it wasn't a complete, it wasn't a complete episode of just pain and failure. There was a, there's, a, there's a little bit of lights of hope, little little glimmers of hope here and there. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Please like and subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and leave any comments below, any recommendations, any tips, because God knows I need them. <laughs> Or just stop by to say good day because I promise I'll respond to everyone because I absolutely love the interactions. But most of all, please have a fantastic day. Bye bye.